Hey what's up guys, in today's video I am going to show you how can you add custom column in WordPress post type. So this is the product post type as you can see and this is the columns that you can add by code in WordPress. So let's start. So in my plugin file first I have a filter hook which is manage added product columns. So you have to just change it with your post type name. For example my post type name is product. That's why I have written product inside it. In case post type is changed, then you have to change it there. So in this callback function, it is giving us columns which I am going to modify. I am going to give it my own keys. For example, product SKU and the showing name is product SKU which is just showing there. Second one is product price which is showing there also in front and there. So this is just showing of names, after that I am going to show their values like these values in there. So to show this value we have a action hook, I am going to uncomment it. And in this action hook we have also changed the post type name there. And after that it is giving us column which we just return it there and the post id. For example, it is giving us this post ID. After that, I have a switch loop. And in the case of product SKU, which we have got from the previous action. And if this key is coming, then we have to show this value from database. So I am going to refresh my front end to show the values is showing or not. So as you can see the values are showing from database. You can show it there your own text. For example I am going to give my name. And I am going to refresh it. So as you can see my name is coming. And after that as you can see if I click on the name then it will be sortable. As you can see in the URL. So we have to give it also sortable. So to sortable these columns we have another filter hook and I am going to use it. First of all we have to give it column names which we have declared there in the first function. And the column key must be same which we have declared in our previous functions. And after that I am going to refresh my front end. As you can see the sortable icon is coming now and as I click on it, it will sort the values in the ascending and for another click it will show the values in descending. So as you can see product SKU and the product SKU and product price is also sortable as you can see. So guys by this way you can show custom columns in any post type by these three functions. So if you find my video useful don't forget like, subscribe and share. Thanks for watching my video.